by integrating service learning into courses, students are able to work on real problems with real people instead of abstract problems. And what's important about this besides being exposed to these communities is it lets students have more motivation and feeling what they're doing is something real rather than an abstract toy problem. Last year, the theme of the course was designing for the refugee crisis. So for example, one team worked on an app for people on the ground in Greece as boats were coming in from Syria to be able to get the right rescue teams to the right place in time for helping people. What excites me most about teaching a cardinal course is that the students are self-selecting as people who are really interested in solving these problems. So they really engage in the problem, they really engage in people's stories. And in fact, last year in our refugee course, there were uh, several times where you know we were crying in class because the stories were so vivid and personal and important. We create the virtual The theme of the course this year is designing for those who've been left out of the technology revolution. My team in particular was able to explore diversity and gender in tech. And so what we implemented was a solution in order to tackle unconscious bias in performance reviews and performance evaluations. Oftentimes in Silicon Valley, we see the same people solving the same problems over and over and over again. But is, what's really going to be amazing is when you get people like me and other people who aren't historically in tech and you get them to start solving problems. This idea that in this course I'd be building something that would not only impact me, but you know, thousands of people in the Bay Area and perhaps even millions of workers across the nation was incredibly compelling and is definitely very different from any other courses that I've taken here at Stanford, which might focus on the theory, but don't actually talk about how can we build this for good. So there's huge problems in the world, whether it's the environment, whether it's access or costs of healthcare, or whether it's education systems that people feel are inadequate. Now in the course, they're not still gonna solve these problems. Not one team is gonna solve global warming, but they can see what type of things they need to do, and this broadens their view of what the possibilities are for engineering.